With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. A rectangular loop of side length this and this centimeter carrying a current of 12 ampere is placed in different orientation as shown in the figure. So these are the figures. First, second, third, fourth. You have to find out in which orientation of the loop stable equilibrium will be. And it is given that there is a uniform magnetic field of 0.3 tesla in positive z direction. Right. Okay. So yeah, you can see already it is uh, it is indicated in the diagram that uh, magnetic field is directed toward the z direction. So if you see here the area vector of the three loop. So if you curl the finger in the direction of this current flowing, you will get the area vector of this will be along x axis. So let's say I, I say it area vector of one. And if I say area vector of two, right? Okay. So this is along, if you see, if you curl the finger in the direction of the current, it is along the z axis. Okay. So if you curl the finger again in the direction of current, you will get to know the area vector in the third case. A3 is along the y axis. And if you see the fourth diagram here, if you curl the finger in the direction of the current, right? Uh, yeah, so this is the direction of the current. So you will get the area vector A4 as negative z axis. Simple. So for stable equilibrium, the area vector and the B vector should be parallel to each other since along the area vector the magnetic moment direction will be directed so i will write if the magnetic moment and the magnetic field are parallel it will be stable equilibrium and if they are anti parallel anti parallel then it will be unstable equilibrium very simple right Okay, so in the question it is asked that what is the condition, which in which of the diagram the stable equilibrium is possible. So if you see in the first diagram, right, uh, the magnetic field in all the diagram is directed toward the z axis but uh, in the first diagram the area vector is along the x axis and in the second diagram the area vector and the magnetic field both are directed toward the z axis in the third diagram again neither parallel nor anti parallel now in this in this case it is pal anti parallel so this will be unstable equilibrium right and uh, if i say this it will be stable equilibrium and as i already told you the magnetic moment will be directed toward the area vector so you could see in the uh, second and the fourth uh, uh, diagram the magnetic field are magnetic field and the uh, magnetic moment are parallel and anti parallel respectively right uh, so yeah in the question it is asked that uh, uh, in which orientation of the loop will be, uh, it will be stable and unstable equilibrium so i will write b and d respectively respectively that will be uh, the second option thank you for class 6 to 12 itg and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today